doing yeah. great, Jimmy. How are you? Why do you have those? Those are things I only have. I just, I just like to ask you a couple of questions about uh, oh, I your see fabulous what. trip to uh, Saint Tropez. Okay, all right. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> right. What's, 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 Here, what's, I'll what's, hold it up for what's you. going on with that, Jimmy? Well, that's that's me on a vacation with Magic and Cookie. Yeah. Yeah. Uh huh. What's this one right here? That is me still on vacation with Magic and. LL Cool J and a bunch of other guys, yeah. yeah. Yeah, and what's up with that one right there? That's me on vacation with Magic. Are you, are you, let me see. There I am right in the yeah, back. I see. Yeah. I, I bring these out, uh -huh. and, and I ask you this question uh -huh. because uh, I was actually on vacation with Magic and Cookie. Oh, yeah, we had a great time. Y yeah, I... I did. How, how did I? How did we miss each other? <laughs> you know what the true story is. No, I don't talk to him. Here's me. the true story. I have asked Magic and Sam Jackson no, no less than uh, Magic. I've asked seven times. Sam uh -huh. Jackson, I've asked three times. Every time they say, "Yeah, we'll invite you. You can come out on the trip on the summer." Jim, and, and then it never happens. You have to. So you have I, to stop I, asking. I, you, well, <laughs> I took matters in my own hands and photoshopped myself into the, their photo. I see. And almost everyone believed I was there. I actually believed it the first day you did it. <laughs> and I was like, what the hell? I was like, but wait a minute, I was there. <laughs> the, the very first day you did it, I was like, why did I miss my, my guy? <laughs> yeah, you I know. really want to go. You did go, though. I did. That's, uh, well, how, did now, how did you get invited to that? Uh, uh, Magic sent uh, a solid gold brick to the house. <laughs> he that, threw it through the window? Yeah, no, 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 no. He, I, oh, no uh, uh, a brink truck pulled up and, and just delivered a solid gold brick to offset the cost that it was going to. Uh, I see. Oh, that so I was going to incur for, for being in Central so Bay. So you did incur a cost. To a a be slight there. cost. A slight cost. I see. But it was it was well worth it, man. Did I, you fly out there with Magic? Uh, I did not. Oh. I, I flew out there with my wife. But uh -huh. uh, in flying out there, I said and did things, in particular said things that I never thought I'd say. Like? Like, uh, I got a text from uh, Magic's assistant, uh, Natalie, uh, saying, um, Mr. Johnson would like you to be in the front of Hermes at 545 because the dinghy will take you out to the yacht. And I was like, oh, well, you know, my, my flight lands in Nice at 6.45, which is two hour, a two-hour drive. But herein lies a thing that I never thought I'd say. Ask Magic if my helicopter could land on his yacht. <laughs> Things a kid from Compton I never thought I'd say in my life. And was serious and meant it. I don't, yeah, oh, did he say no? Yes, he did. Oh, he did. <laughs> He did, he did, but but I was I was I is was dead ass serious. Is it that big that a helicopter could land on it? The, the yacht is two hundred and eighty feet long. So it's, in other words, there'd be plenty of room for me. Oh yes. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. So they just don't want me to be they there. Probably. Well, you know, I can't. Maybe. Maybe there was there was so many people that looked like me there. Let's go through this. <laughs> I feel like I oh, could provide where, some where much needed you, diversity. I'm just going to ask you again, what yeah. diversity and inclusion? Where yeah. would you be in that picture right there? <laughs> Jimmy, where would you be? I'd probably be just right here eating this tea plate. <laughs> 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 no, you know what's crazy? That, we, Who's that, in this picture? We're, uh, 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 Is that uh, Dave Paul, Winfield? The, the Dave Winfield Hall oh. of Famer and his wife, Tanya. Yeah. I love Sam, Sam and Latanya Jackson, Irvin and Cookie Johnson, Angela Bassett and, and her husband. Wow. Uh, what's, what's his name? Uh, Courtney <laughs> B. Vance. Uh -huh. Me and my wife, uh, Spike and Latanya Lee and Pauletta Washington, Denzel's wife. Yeah, looks yeah. like you guys had fun without we, me. We did. And we, then it was in the newspaper locally in San Tropez. Uh, we woke up the next day and this was on the front page of the San Tropez paper. Keep the camera there, yes. as you guys notice. Anthony Anderson is the only name mentioned. <laughs> only name mentioned. <laughs> with all those heavyweights right there. You're the Anthony Anderson. With international appeal. It's set on rouge. It's set on rouge for la rouge de la chanson yacht. Says yacht. Right there. Was this your first time going on this trip? Uh, first time. I, I've been invited several times before. <laughs> <laughs> but and, for, the first time I was able to ever uh, to make it work with my schedule. I yes. see. And, and was it as great as it seems like it would be? Words cannot begin to, uh, to describe the fun and excitement 
that were that that was there that entire was region. it like entertainment on the yacht was uh it... no no entertainment on the yacht that's just where they lived it was like a floating apartment in oh. the mediterranean sea i see yeah they, they had a full equinox uh, on the bottom level of the boat that's a, how big the boat is a gym or the uh... no 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 the full gym okay wow the, yeah and you know what's crazy? You know, you have dinghies that take you out to the boat. Uh-huh. Uh, uh, Irvin had a ferry that took you out to his boat. Really? That's how big his boat was. A ferry picked you up and took you to his boat. Oh, wow. But the entertainment so was... there's plenty of room on the ferry if I were to be Plenty of like room there. on the ferry, yeah. plenty of room on the boat. Uh-huh. Uh, th there's... I'll tell you how big this yacht was. This yacht was so big that it housed three smaller yachts in the bow of it. <laughs> I I'm not lying. No, it didn't. There were three boat. There were three. There were three boats bigger than your soundstage in the bow of this oh. boat. And was anyone on them? No, that was just for decoration. <laughs> because a ferry brought me out to the yacht. But you you talk about you talk about entertainment. Uh, so the entertainment for for Cookie's birthday party for her surprise was Jeffrey Osborne, oh. Cheryl Lynn. Shaka oh. Khan, Eddie Levert, Charlie Wilson. These are all my favorites. Yeah, all of ours, too. <laughs> all of ours, too. And then, so we thought the show was over. So we're sitting out there in, in the, the ocean. The, the sea is right there. It's beautiful. It's outside. It's, it's at the Citadel, which is an old fort and castle. He had people dancing on the side of the wall and trapeze. And then he called everybody to the floor and said, I want everybody to come out here and celebrate you know, uh, our birthday with us. Everybody come up back out to the dance floor. And so we're all on the dance floor. And we think we're about to sing happy birthday to him. And then all of a sudden, uh, Irvin says, ladies and gentlemen, Earth, Wind, and Fire! And all, all 116 members of Earth, Wind, and Fire start performing on the stage, man. That's how I'm going to get in. Yeah. First, <laughs> first I'm going to try out to be in Earth, Wind, and Fire. <laughs> <laughs> you can play a symbol. You can do a little something. All right. Anthony Anderson is here. He's rubbing it in. But we have more with Anthony. His show Blackish comes back a week from tomorrow right here on ABC. We'll be right back. I don't even recognize this guy. He's not the settling down type. Maybe he loves then leaves. The pops I know would never allow himself to be caught giggling. Hey, what you staring at? You never seen two people dancing together to music that's not playing? You know, this is crazy. I'm trying to find out what your game is. Well, I'll tell you. It's simple. I'm in love, sweet love, dummy. <laughs> that is Anthony Anderson on season six of Blackish, which comes back a, a week from tomorrow, for which you are nominated for an Emmy on Sunday. Congratulations Thank you. on that. Thank you. Thank you. How many, how many years in a row have you been nominated? Uh, all five years that we've been on the air. All five years Yes, yeah, so on that means I've, I've lost. Every year, too. But it's time now. It's time. It's time. Can, can, can we uh, congratulate Jimmy Kimmel and, and Norman Lear for winning an Oscar this past weekend? An Emmy. An Emmy. An Emmy. Unless he knows I'm about it. <laughs> well, you're, not, fun. you're not free solo. First of all, thank you again for being part of, of that show, playing Henry Jefferson on All in the Family. Yes. Uh, with the reboot. And you were there. We hung out. We actually sat right next to each other. Yeah. Which was fun. Mm -hmm. It's a long show, but we had a lot of... We, we had, did. We made I, a lot of comments. And it, we are, with some that we can say and some we can't. Right. Uh, I'm curious, though. Uh, about what? What was the $100 bet that you... Or the $100... Why did you give your wife, Molly, $100? And, I'll, and I'll say this, I'll we're sitting there. And then I have a question. Okay, we're, we're sitting yeah. there, and all of a sudden, Jimmy just pulls out a wad of hundreds. <laughs> and he just peels one off and hands to his wife. So I stick my hand out, and he peels one off and gives to me. <laughs> and Molly says, don't you dare give it back to him. <laughs> I so I pulled out my wad of hundreds and wrapped it around mine and put it in my pocket. <laughs> and so... I never knew what that transaction was about. So do you care? Is it something well, you can talk about on air? Yes, absolutely. Okay. I mean, it's, it's not that interesting. But first of all, I want you to know that yesterday I was, uh, like, putting my money, and it wasn't a lot of hundreds. There happened to be two on the outside. So, and I'm looking at it, and I go, oh, Anthony kept my $100. <laughs> and, but it was, my wife wanted to go get some pretzels to bring them back. And then when she came back, they'd closed the line. They cut it off. I so remember that. That's what the money that's was what You know, pretzels are, are expensive, expensive at that. Especially at Microsoft. At that Microsoft <laughs> yeah. theater, yeah. So that, okay. 
That's what the 100 was for. It wasn't like, what did you think it was for? I had for? no idea. You, I just saw my brother Jimmy giving out money, and I wanted my car. I have to pay my wife. <laughs> I, our deal is, I told her that if you agree to marry me, I'll pay you $100 an hour. <laughs> <laughs> so, Blackish, you now have two spinoff shows, which really is the mark of a successful show. Yes. Like, for instance, Norman Lear. There were so many spinoffs from All in the Family, The Jeffersons, Ma... And, now, you have two spinoff shows, Grownish and Mixedish. Yes. Are you part of those programs? Yes, I am. You are. Yes, you will I be am. You're appearing on them. Uh, yes. I, I, well, Mixedish, probably not, because that is about uh, Rainbow's childhood character growing up a mixed oh. child living on a commune. So you would have to literally travel in time Tra to yes. do that. Yes. yes. But that's possible. But that's possible. <laughs> you, you might see a young Dre. Uh-huh. Like, like, we have flashbacks on Blackish. But I, I am, I've been on, on Grownish throughout uh, all three or four seasons that they've been around now. Well, it's, it's uh, really, it is remarkable how strong it, the show still is yeah. and how it keeps going. And, and, of course, your big Emmy nomination on Sunday. I'll be seeing, you know what, I'm going to give you another $100. I appreciate that. that. Yeah. Well, while we're speaking about the Emmys, yeah. I, I understand, you know, the Emmys that, you know, we all won collectively were for the producers, but do the actors get those too? Apparently not. Yeah, the actors do not get those, yeah. So, without the actors, you wouldn't have been able to produce anything. I know, it would have been just a, it was just, just furniture, really. really? <laughs> <laughs> oh, but, yeah, oh man, damn it, I thought I could get one. Because it doesn't look good again this year for me. It's not? It's some stiff you competition. Don't feel so? I always feel great about it. This they're, year, I'm like, ah. Of course, there are great actors it, in the category. It's, it's Don Cheadle. It's Bill Hader. It's, uh -huh. it's Ted Danson. It's Michael Douglas. Yeah. Then, and, yeah. and then a kid from Compton. Yeah, but don't you love that your name is on that list? I do, actually. Guys? I do. Yeah, well, congratulations. Anthony Anderson, everybody. Thank you. $100. Season 6 of Blackish, a week from tomorrow, 9.30 here on ABC. Hi, I'm Jimmy Kimmel. If you want to see all our latest videos, click the subscribe button. And if you don't, click anyway and close your eyes when they come on.